please scan through that list and see if that user is listed over there. And if that user is listed over there, now check for what he's trying to do on top. So let's say if it is user one trying to access, or let's say user two trying to access object one, and he wants to write to that object, and user two doesn't have write permission on that object. So you should be denied permission. So that's why we check whether a particular user has access to a particular object with respect to what he's trying to do. If he's trying to read, yes, you can let him to read. But if he's trying to write to that object, you cannot let him to do that. Okay? So what's the complexity? You have to really index to that object and really go to the list. So there will be n objects in the worst case, so the complexity is order of n. If you want to do it on a capability list, again, you want to check whether a particular user can access a particular object. So here you index the users and go through the list and see whether you can access that object. So same complexity, but the other way, because here you want to scan the list of objects of that user right now. So it's going to be order of n. Okay, so that's the only difference. If it's an access control matrix, you know a matrix is like basically all the users over here and the objects over here. So you have to really check each cell. Okay, so at the worst case, you'll have to do what? This is list of uh, how many users? N users and N objects. So at the worst case, you have to index N times. So you have to really check every cell and see whether uh, whatever you're searching for is there. Okay? At the worst case, you have to search for the whole matrix. Now, if what about this? How easy it is to add a new uh, user and uh, let's say you are introducing a new user to a system. Okay? And you want to make have him be able to access an objects with some permissions. Okay, so the second call, the second thing is you want to add a new user to the system. Okay, so if you want to add a new user to the system, what should you do? In this case, if 